All right, quiz 10. Uh, and this is the two star set. Number one, who had a thorn in the flesh? Number two, who made a fire on the beach and cooked fish? Three, which tree did the Lord destroy? Four, who took a viper off his hand? Five, which apostle had a vision of animals in a sheet? Six, who said, Thou art the Christ, the Son of the living God? Seven, where were the disciples told they would find a cult tied? All right, now here are the answers to that set of questions. Number one, who had a thorn in the flesh? That answer is found in 2 Corinthians, 2 Corinthians chapter 12 and verse number 7. It says, And lest I should be exalted above measure through the abundance of the revelations, there was given to me a thorn in the flesh, the messenger of Satan, to buffet me, lest I should be exalted above measure. So this is Paul speaking, and he says he has a thorn in the flesh. So the answer is Paul. Number two, who made a fire on the beach and cooked fish? That answer is found back in the Gospel of John, chapter 21, and verse number nine. It says, as soon as they were come to land, they saw a fire of coals there, and fish laid thereon, and bread. Jesus saith unto them, Bring of the fish which ye have now caught. So, the answer is Jesus Christ. Jesus is the one that, that uh, made that fire and cooked the fish. Number three, which tree did the Lord destroy? That answer is found in Matthew 21, 19. Matthew 21. And verse 19, it says, And when he saw a fig tree in the way, he came to it and found nothing thereon but leaves only, and said unto it, Let no fruit grow on thee henceforth forever. And presently the fig tree withered away. So the answer is a fig tree. Fig tree. Number four, who shook a viper off his hand? That answer is found in the book of Acts. Acts chapter 28, verses 3 and 6. And when Paul had gathered a bundle of sticks and laid them on the fire, there came a viper out of the heat and fastened on his hand. And when the barbarians saw the venomous beast hang on his hand, they said among themselves, No doubt this man is a murderer, whom, though he hath escaped the sea, yet vengeance suffereth not to live. And he shook off the beast into the fire and felt no harm. So the answer is, is Paul. Paul is, is the one. He was the answer to question number one, and he's answered to question number four. All right, number five. Which apostle had a vision of animals in a sheet? That answer is also found in the book of Acts, uh, back in chapter 10. Acts 10, 11 through 13, it says, And saw heaven open, and a certain vessel descending unto him, as it had been a great sheet knit at the four corners, and let down to the earth, wherein were all manner of four-footed beasts of the earth, and wild beasts, and creeping things, and fowls of the air. And there came a voice to him, and there came a voice to him, Rise, Peter, kill and eat. So the answer is Peter. Peter. Number six. Who said, Thou art the Christ, the Son of the living God? That answer is found over in the Gospel of Matthew. Matthew chapter 16 and verse number 16. It says, And Simon Peter answered and said, Thou art the Christ, the Son of the living God. So Simon Peter is the answer. He's the answer to two questions in a row. Peter. Number seven. Where were the disciples told they would find a cult tied? That answer is found in the next book over from where we just were. In Mark chapter 11 and verse number 4. 
It says, and they went their way and found the colt tied by the door without a without in a place where two ways met and they loose him. So the answer is a place where two ways met. And that's significant because if you study that out, the donkey is a picture of a lost person bound in their sins and they're being set free. They're being led to Christ, um, but they're found in a place where two ways met. One way goes to hell, the other way goes to heaven. And that's the situation every lost person is in, hell or heaven, which one's it going to be? Um, but anyway, the answer to number seven, the cult was found in a place where two ways met. So that concludes the questions and answers for the two-star set uh, for quiz number 10.